Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. And our live game is Manchester City against Tottenham. I'm Peter Drury and it's a pleasure to be alongside Jim Begley. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. Uh, ready to see what unfolds in this one now. in games of this nature who can make the difference yeah Toby Alderweireld he's rock solid at the back Peter with all the physical and technical attributes you'd look for in the center half what's more he can really pick out a pass too he loves a diagonal so opposition defenses just can't swish off yes he'd be my pick too it's gonna to be all about how they get the best out of him front Perisic Foden Gundogan it's still well to tidy up the situation Perisic looking up to see who wants it Good challenge, he just stood firm, goes wide, Perisic looking to get on the end of this, Bissouma trying to play it through, well he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that, Grealish, Foden, oh we don't even need to look at the stats do we Peter, zero attempt, zero goals and uh, excitement, forget it. Tries a through ball. Goal! City! Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. It's so often the case with goal scorers, little influence, and all of a sudden, bang. De Bruyne. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Good defence, uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. Lops it in gently. Laporte cuts it out. Who's going to make this theirs? Greenish takes a look up. Oh, he's come flying in. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. It's a brilliant interception. 
he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passion. I think he's letting him know right now about just a little more behind him than needed. Battles to win it back. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. And that's going to be a booking. Richarlison boots it to safety. The first half is done. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Manchester City head to the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. Manchester City carry a one-goal lead into the second half. You felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. De Bruyne pushes it out wide. It's Bernardo Silva. Davis tries to get it forward quickly. Stones. Ruben Diaz. Gundogan. Ruben Diaz. Foden is being picked on here. Yeah, better communication and, and lots of contact seems to be the, the route to quietening him down now. Foden. Manchester City just about have their noses in front. It is the slenderest of leads. It's the channel. Gets it into the middle. And back out it comes. Dyer seems now to be all about wit. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Kane proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Loose ball, who's going to get that? Jao Cancel. Son Kyung Min. Gets it back. Defence got the again. Greenish. That's the throw. Now the pass. And that's clear cut. It's a free kick. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. It's well blocked and back out it comes. Uh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Gundogan, De Bruyne, passes it through, oh well defended, that had to be done. Longley knocks it away. I suspect there'll have been a few nails chewed off during that attack. How they survived, I'm not quite so sure. But their lead is intact, and that's all that matters. And it's Perisic. Looks to slip it through. Kane. And the referee brings it to a close. Manchester City hold on. It's a narrow squeak. Bit of luck.